What's going on? All right, so we're out here at Harlow Pond. I'm here with Kenny. Oh, go, and we're gonna try to do some fishing today. Um, we decided to come up here because we knew there was ice and should be a pretty good time. Hopefully we can reel something in. So we're gonna get set up and see if we can catch some fish. Hope you guys enjoy. See you in a minute. Quite a few people out here today. <clears throat> we didn't bring the shack today. It's been a kind of a quick decision. We just decided to get out here. This one here has DB's leader on it. Oh yeah? That he sent us, what, last year? Yep. Cool. Let's see how that does. And get it down through the ice. There we go. Just cold enough to get your fingertips wet and your fingertips feel numb. All right, bait's all yours. Sweet. <laughs> Let's go set some traps. All right, I'm drilling my holes. Kenny's getting all set up over there. So I'm gonna finish getting mine, mine in. And then, uh, yeah, hopefully we can catch a fish. So we'll see you guys in a minute. Let's go fishing. I've been waiting to get out again. And yes, we came back to Harlow, but we got other places planned. That we haven't got to yet. If I can get bait out of here. There's number one. Sweet. Let's go to number two. Ah, it's nice to get out.
And then there is number two. I like to set them off before I put them in and make sure everything's working correctly. Sweet! Next! Oh, it's good to be out fishing. Okay. <coughs> I've, I've also noticed that every time I fish here, I don't go down that deep. Yeah, I only went two to three feet. I think a couple of them aren't even that, maybe. There's three. See you at the next one. <laughs> you having fun, Coco? <laughs> that one little stick of wood and she's happy as a pig and shit. Yeah. With her coat. She looks so cute with that freaking coat. <laughs> All right, we're working on number four. Oh, flag. Another one? When I first got here, my hands were cold, and now they're not. Yeah, same. Mine got cold, and now they're used to it, apparently. That ice froze on top of it, right? That fish wasn't very lively. Coco, don't eat that. Hey, <laughs> don't eat it, you'll get sick. Yeah, I, I went to Jimmy's to get bait, and he's like, it was uh, his son there. And uh, he says, yeah, these bait aren't very lively, so I'll give you a few extra. Only one passed away. Only one passed away. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I held a small funeral, but nobody showed up. Just There's me, number four. Me and Coco for the funeral. Yeah, well, he didn't invite me. We could have had a, the little dinner thing afterwards. <laughs> yeah, I thought about doing the old uh, Greek thing where you put him in a boat and burn it. <laughs> It's all, everything's got a little bit of ice on it so you can't send the boat out. Right. All right, let's get this last one in. And now, number five. This one trap's got a small hook and the rest have big hooks. Maybe that's your lucky one. Small hook catch big fish. Old Indian wives tail. So there, now we got five in, and I'm not going to go very deep on this one because I'm here, sure. So now we got them all in. We got one, two, three, four, five. And then Kenny's got his all along the other side of me. And now we wait. I go home, I keep them in, I had to send these leftovers. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. Oh, got your thumb. These come from PJ's? Uh, uh, Misty there in Dover. Oh, yeah. And then uh, a dozen from CJ's there in Milo. You from Dover? No. Broad. Outside of Brownville. Oh wow, you come all the way down here to go fishing? It's the only ice to fish. <laughs> oh really? Does not up that way? <laughs> no. Yeah, I've been watching a lot of those sites on Facebook and that's what everybody's saying. There's nowhere to fish really. It's a few places. No, and it didn't open up there till the 15th, so. Alright. I'm kind of screwed that way. Yeah. So that getting open till the 15th and scooter's got no ice on it. None. You watch, you watch any YouTube? I watched a couple. 
I, I do a YouTube channel um, where I, I do ice fishing and treasure hunting and all that. Yeah. Um, if you want a sticker? Sure. Yeah, that's my channel. Cool. Yeah, do a lot of stuff. We do uh, deer cutting and moose and all that during the, the fall. Well, it's hard to find them now because everybody's closing up. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, we dealt with that. Yeah, I know. When uh, what's their names? The Charleston clothes, Whistlers. Oh, Whistlers. My phone. I didn't even want to answer it. It was non-stop every two minutes. Yeah, I ended up going to the guys over there in uh, Parkman. It's Parkman. Yeah. Oh, Bailey Brothers. Yeah, and I wasn't real happy with it. Yeah, we heard that. You try us out next year, Kenny's when guts. I, when I when I try it, I got my. About six inches. Yeah, I got my gear off there and walked in the back door, got it off. The cars were nothing but freaking blood. There was blood all over the floor, pieces of meat laying all over the floor. I'm like, yeah, I don't know about all this shit. Wow. Now when I got it back, none of it was frozen. It was all still soft. Yeah, we don't freeze either. We have like a 24-hour pickup window. Right. When I give you a call or a text, then you got 24 hours to pick it up. Um, but yeah, we, we we do a good job. It's all commercially vacuum sealed. You can check it right out on his page. Yeah, yeah. my deer, the deer that I brought back this year because I went to Wisconsin and hunted again. Yeah. And because you can't bring it back whole, it was all quartered up and the guys down in Dexter wouldn't take it. Yeah, we take them. Yeah, we take Would them all the time. Them. If it would have been a whole deer, yeah, then they would have skinned it out and cut it up, but they weren't taking any quarters. I don't know why, it's easier. Yeah. We don't have to skin it, we don't have you to quarter it, it's all done. grind it. Right. Yeah, most you times we just throw it right on the table, we can do it right up. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I appreciate it. I'll... Yeah, Kenny's got some Palmyra. Yeah, we got, all, uh, we got all kinds of videos on there. Of our... You guys do sausage and all that stuff too? Yeah, just ground, we don't do tubes. But we do uh, breakfast, sweet, hot, garlic and cheese and maple. I had Worcesters do a deer for me a few years ago, and I got it back, thawed it out, of course, went to slice a piece and it just crumbled up. I said, there ain't no freaking fat in this shit yeah. to hold it together. Yeah. So I called him on the phone and bitched about her, and says, she says, well, do like we do, just put it in chop suey. I said, that ain't the fucking point. And that ain't what I fucking paid for. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I want to eat the shit on a sandwich. I don't want to fucking crumble it up like ground meat. Right, like if you want pork or beef in your grinds, I always ask you when you bring your deer in and we yeah, put it I right do on the paper. Yeah, I do at least 20%. Yeah, that's yeah, what we do. It holds it together. 15 to 20%. Yeah. All right, guys, have a good have a good yeah, day. Well, you thank too. You. Thanks for the bait. Yes, sir. Well, hi. So that nice fella, uh, did you get his name? No, I didn't. Damn it. I didn't even think to ask. Yeah. Um, came over and they offered us a dozen and a half bait. <laughs> so, cool, we said sure. He's a pretty nice guy too. Um, All the way from Brownville. Yep, came from Brownville and said there wasn't no ice anywhere else. And that's what everybody's been saying. So now you see why we're at Harlow, because we know there's ice and usually you catch some pretty good fish here. So we'll see what happens. See you guys in a minute. All right, we've been here for about an hour or so. And I'm really happy because I just ran down my trap line. Um, but yeah, I gotta check them all. So I'm gonna set you right over here. Hopefully you can see. That one's still good. The bait is still alive. You guys ever see a dog that checks ice traps? She she knows what trap she knows what trap you're going to. Yeah. Like you could go to you could walk across and start walking this way and she'd go to the trap you're going to. She's something else. Alright. A little snow bank here. See if you guys can see me. Let me check this one. They're starting to freeze a little bit. Well, I heard yell, somebody yell flag. I got 
a not so lively bait on this one. Well, what the heck? This one was not moving at all, and then all of a sudden it goes, you don't see it. <laughs> This one's all good. Hey, I don't even care. I want to catch fish, but you know, it's more just about being out here. And usually you sit here long enough, you'll get one. It's nice to get out though. We got some other trips planned soon. And this one's all good. Beautiful. That one's still squirming. Okay. One more. Oh, oh, she took off on me. Oh yeah, that one was right in the weeds. Well, now you're alive. <sighs> right in the weeds. It's still good. All right, so we'll put that one just below the eyes. Sweet, they're all set and ready to go. Hopefully we can catch a fish. So tell me what you guys think. Okay, we're sitting here ice fishing. I know that the, the snowmobiles don't bother the fish that much, but these guys are racing across the lake. They keep coming right up and driving right through our ice traps. And then they then they stop right at the end of my line, and then they all hammer right from there across the lake. Like, you think they would, could stop a little bit shorter. I don't know, maybe it's just me being anal, but you've got three sleds pulling in all around our ice traps. It's kind of like... Annoying. Yeah. I don't know. I just figured I had to bitch for a second. Tell me what you guys think. I think it's fucking kind of ignorant. So, but that's me. See you in a minute.
cool, but you can, they got all this over here. They can pull in over there and race up and down all they want. Makes no sense to me. Well, hopefully we can get a fish today. We'll see you guys in a bit. First flag. Slow down, Coco. She's excited too. Yay. Pickle. Pickle. Woo. Oh, well, first flag. And yeah, my bait's still alive. Sort of. Good enough. Awesome, I got my first fish of the year. How did it feel? Excellent day. Yeah, now it's my turn. I still yeah. have you not got a flag yet this year, so <laughs> we'll see. Here she is. Kenny's first fish of the year. Woo! All right, let's see if we catch some more. See you guys. All right, we're just checking the bait again. Well, it's still kicking pretty good. Back down the hole it goes. Well, at least we didn't get skunked out here yet. I mean, well, I mean, not yet, but we gotta. That little pickle. Well, that bait's still wicked lively. I hear the eagle. All right, I'm gonna check these other two and we'll see if we get a fish. All right, All right. so Aaron's gonna drill another hole right in front of this culvert over here. See how close we can get to it. Say we can get pretty close. I'll stand over here though while he drills. Quite a bit of ice right there. Don't drop it. <laughs> it scared me. There but, you go. All right, I'm gonna move that trap right there. Right there. How much water is in it? Well, I can see the weeds. There's weeds right there too. Well. Oh, I see a flag. Yeah, I finally got a flag. <laughs> but for shits and giggles, I'm gonna try it right here. Oh, another flag. I just don't want it to be touching the bottom. Mm. Oh, it's sitting right on bottom. May not be enough water. Damn it. <laughs> Cut it out. <laughs> well. I'll try it anyways. Could be a good brook trout spot. You never know. Yeah, but it's like sitting right on the bottom. Wheel it all the way almost up then. It's about it. I might have to move the hole. Oh. Oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Must have a lot of weight on that one.
got it. He's swimming just high off the uh, the bottom. Let's cool. see. Try to show you. I'd put it under water, but I got my speaker on, so I can't. Perfect. It's gonna give me a big drought. This is the other side of the lake. Mm. Look at the water. You can see the water. Is it just me? It looked like it was growing across the top of the ice. No, it's not just you. Well, maybe. It looks like it's taking over that white spot. Yeah. Weird. Ice is sinking. I don't know why they always put pumpkins up there. They should take them down after Halloween. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I, I don't even know how they get them up there. Yeah. Helicopter? Maybe they tie rope around them like they do with the shoelaces. All right. <coughs> well, Kenny's had one. We're going to pick up here soon. Um, I have not even had a flag, so I guess my fishing season hasn't really started yet. <laughs> but, yeah, I'm going to pick them up in a minute, so we'll see you then. Listen to, listen to how wild this sled is. Super loud. It's screaming across the lake. It's pretty cool. But I don't know. I wouldn't want to sled that loud. But anyways, we got all of our trans picked up. We're heading out for the day. Bunch of pickerel caught. Um, didn't see any trout by anybody, but it's still fun to get out. At least Kenny got a flag. We'll see you next time. Maybe I'll catch a fish. Keep on naturing. Peace.